God created man and woman, he created sex, and he said that it was good. But over time, we corrupted it, causing our views on sex, love, and marriage to eventually be redefined. In an age where the church has shamed the sentiment gift and the world has perverted it, how are we to respond? The truth is, we're all born with a sex drive, and it is our job to learn how to manage it. What we need is a moral revolution that cultivates a culture of love, honor, and respect, empowering a generation to walk in wholeness and to value their hearts. See, the reason why you have a sex drive years before God wants you to have sex inside of, of covenant is because the value of your virginity is in the blood, sweat, and tears it takes to get it from the battlefield to the bedroom so that on your honeymoon night, you have something to offer your lover that you had the fight to keep. The time has come to know who you are and whose you are, to take a stand for purity, to begin a real, honest look at a subject as old as Adam and Eve.